We didn't do anything about mental health and wellness. You definitely need that. Today. I just want to say that I hate people acting like people Can are you using. Say something positive. No, I hate no. people <laughs> acting like people are using mental health as a marketing tool. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? Like, and I, I keep hearing people say that, like, "Oh, everybody got anxiety now." Well, why are they saying? Why are they? Oh, they're saying that the people who are talking about their mental health conditions like, are they like to say themselves? that I'm making money off it? I haven't made no fucking money off it. How do I? How do you make they, money? Well, because you wrote a book called Shook One. Yeah, but that was a book that I was going to write regardless. Before. No, but I'm saying they are saying that because you wrote about mental health that you benefited from it, which I think is fine. It's your story. Okay, so yeah, so that means in black privilege, I benefited from selling crack. I benefited from radio. I benefited from yeah, artists I've interviewed. I benefited from issues with my father. Here's, By here's, the way, I talk about anxiety and black privilege too. I know, but here's the thing. I'm not like defending them at all. Mm -hmm. I think all I'm saying is because people are so uncomfortable with the topic, with you like right there in their face, like, oh, this, you know, this is happening with Leonard or Charlemagne. This is happening with Taraji. This is happening with, um, you talked about Andre 3000 talking about his mm -hmm. anxiety. And stuff. Like whomever, like they're going to see it as negative and find something wrong with it because it prevents them from having to deal with their mental health yes. issues. And I would like to make one simple statement what? to everyone. When people say, oh, everybody's talking about anxiety now, and everybody's talking about depression, and everybody's talking about mental we're health. talking about it enough. But you know why people, more people are talking about it now? Because we're creating a safe, safe space, space for people to talk Imagine about that. it. Imagine that. Because you have people like Taraji saying yeah. it. You have me saying it. You have Wale. You have Big Sean. You have, all, you have people talking about yeah. it more openly now. So it's making everybody feel mm -hmm. more comfortable to talk about it. Yeah. What's the problem? Like, that's, that's what happens. There, the problem is their comfortability. Right. Like you're talking about something that's so untouchable to them, so taboo. Mm -hmm. Right. For a lot of people, it makes them feel uncomfortable. So they will rather pretend like it's not there, not knowing that once they um, accept what's, you know, in them and before them, like they're probably going to be a little more whole. Yeah. So I would say keep doing it. If it's a marketing tool in that it's not like you're selling anything, but if it's a marketing tool and that it's always in their face, like those um, infomercials that used to come in when BT was over. <laughs> yeah, 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 for Keep real. Keep it right there. By the way, y'all don't complain when y'all see all this negative bullshit in your face all the time. Yeah. You don't be like, oh, you talk about guns too much. Yeah. Oh, you talk about smoking weed too much. Oh, you talk about, you know, sleeping with a bunch of different women too much. I don't hear that. Oh, yeah. you talk about popping Zanny too much. You know, yeah. I don't hear none of that. But when it or ever is something. The, the, the high, the Bugatti. Price you talk about Bugatti's yeah. too much. Like, you don't never hear that. But whenever it's something positive, especially from black people whenever there's something positive we always try to look for the negative angle and act like oh the reason this person is doing it is for is for re reasons that aren't genuine i don't gain nothing from this so i'm just saying all that to say is to be whole like however yes, you need man. to be whole however you need to heal yes we support that and, and stop it's not marketing it's not marketing and stop just when you hear more people talking about it like i said it's because we have created a safe space for people to talk about it. People don't feel it's, it's scared to talk about yeah. it anymore. It's not as taboo to talk about. It's like, and in order to eradicate the stigma, people got to tell their stories. Let people tell their stories and shut the fuck up forever until you're willing to tell yours. Is that how you feel? Yes. You want to say something positive before you leave today? Hakuna Matata.